Hello, welcome to Ghana Weekend TV. My name is Kwame Dazi, and today I refuse to be broke because I'm here with um, a very, very, very rich Ghanaian musician. Right right you said you refuse to be broke, and that's why you're out to be right? Yep. You refuse to be broke. Yes. Okay, so today I'm part of this group officially. Um, <laughs> now we are three, so I will be <laughs> a trio yep. officially part of. Refuse to, to be broke. broke. Oh, are you not admitting it, more people? Uh, oh yeah, of course. We, we had, we, like you said, you said originally two, but now three. But that's wrong, because we are originally thousand. Thousand. With the two of us more spearheading. More. Okay. We were with day front, okay. but okay. So are you counting all your followers? Um, I say fifteen thousand. Fifteen thousand. Because you promised, you promised us doing that. <laughs> The listening session <laughs> everything that's that everything is 15 15 yeah. track album side 15 even if you want to just somebody a girlfriend 15, 15, 15 girlfriend safe one girl 15 girls okay so 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 we are coming to do 15 minutes right yeah. thank of, you of an interview <laughs> <laughs> now, so you the know, minute, the minute alone, be 10. The minute, no, no, wait. So, we are doing 15, 15 girlfriends, 15 million, yes, uh, 15 track album, yes, side 15, everything yeah. 15, yes, yes. Yeah, so going back to basics, every 15 minutes, yeah. but then tell me it will be 10. <laughs> All right, so, um, no, Bobby, yeah, bro, why, why say you stop the rap? Uh, the girls are longer singing, <laughs> uh, so we do them for melody. No, at, at what time? At what time did you realize that you could sing? Uh, it was actually played with a kind of woke me up from rapping and singing. Did you did you coerce him to do that? No, no, it was simple. When we started to record, we, we, we used to go to Music Power in Community to to record demos. Okay. And obviously, I will rap, he will rap, but we need a chorus, right? So then he sings a chorus. Okay. Then we bring the demo home. I'll be playing the demo. Uh, I went to the room. My brother, you didn't sing well, well. Now nah, you don't know. You don't know. So I tell us, you, my brother, you didn't sing well, well. And also, me and you are uh, with the rap. So okay. why you not go focus on singing? Mm -hmm. Look at the rap. Oh, okay. You see, to, to make a fine balance. It was, it, was, uh, it was trouble initially because also, you see, from where we are from, if you didn't sing, I'd be like, you know, hard. Yeah. yeah, we will be hard guys. So if you do rap, if you do rap, rap say, I will be more, you know, that. so he didn't accept it because this one, the mafia will be sitting. He'll be hard <laughs> guy. Well, well. And then along the line, he was like, Can you say, so remember, so the old boy the same. Yes, his father too was a serious musician, wow. not professionally, but his voice, his father's he's voice, yeah. is the same as Mugi's yeah, voice. Yeah, People, yeah. they wonder where Mugi's well, again voice from. Yeah, what we call mother or happy in this one. Oh, okay. Okay. Because some people also loved your rap back then. The one you did with Sammy. Okay. Let's not go. Let's go down. Let's go straight to, to back to the basics. So yep. I have listened to the entire album. I've listened to everything. Okay. I was there at the album. Are they listening? Oh, nice. So I listened to everything. Now, I want to know which basics you guys are going back to. Back to the roots. Which root is that? High life. High life. Typical Ghanaian song. High life. Wow, but I could I could hear some other genres. Yes, because oh. you, you must find a balance. In the past the but the main focus, because if you realize our single, even before the album was a boss, yeah. our next single is Sheer Banker, yeah. which is a, a mixture of Amar Piano and High yeah. Life. You know, so that's the focus. But obviously, you know, we have like a, a serious fan base mm -hmm. and, and with different audiences. Audience, yeah. So we must, we must try and cater for all these mm -hmm. audiences. But the main focus, like you said, if you've listened to the tape, is high life music. Because I listened to you on Ages show, you were saying that what can take Ghana outside of high life. international is high life music. Yeah. But now it appears Afrobeat is is almost everywhere. That is the brand, if you like. And even Koreans and people from other parts of the world are jumping onto Afrobeat. Yes. No, high life is Afro part. <laughs> well, the high life I'm saying, because if you listen to Adekunle Gold, yeah. they are doing high life music. Our yeah. song over. It's a high life song, yeah. but it's an Afrobeat song. When I say high life, I'm not saying we should just create a general. High life is already a general. I'm not saying we should just focus on that. Mm -hmm. The high life sound is what's going to make us. It's going to get us recognized in the Afrobeat community. Okay. Is what I'm trying okay. to say. Okay, I get you. The high life sound is going to take us to. So you. it's high life songs, but it's Afrobeat. Afrobeat from the high life genre. 
yep. yeah. like AJ was saying, yeah. more of the Nigerian songs, the guitars, etc. It's high life guitars. True. And even DJ Brandt here decided to couch a name for Afro beats, as in the one with the S, yeah. to encompass all the African rhythms. Exactly. And that was how come it got uh, marketed across the world. So that's okay. Yeah, now, um, the one you did, a bustle. I heard and I was like, ah, and you're very important. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, yeah. Yeah. There's nothing new under the sun. True. You can, I mean, like, take a look at this container, for example. Now it's clean. Yeah. If you apply a different thing, it's going to change that. It's still the same container. Okay. So that's what we did with the boss of job. I feel like with every artist, like Mugi said too, you can't think anything new. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No human being can think anything new. You know, so the, the, you, what makes you good, what makes you a good creative is how you're able to find the balance. Okay. Not just let it look like this. Exactly. Exact thing. Oh, okay. You know, because sometimes you even create an unconsciously, that's what we call inspiration. Yeah. You call it inspiration. But so it's... Oh, Kwame Eugene is an incredible artist. So. Kwame Eugene. Yeah, because he says he gets inspiration from most of yeah, the Yeah, every artist. Every artist. Like, with me, if I want to, for instance, start maybe a rap project, for like a month or two, I will be playing some particular rap songs mm -hmm. all the time. Okay. All the time. Because you want that particular style. That so sound. Style. But I'm not going to do exactly what I'm listening to. You know, but I'll be inspired and, and, and by that sound. Yeah. Yeah. But I hope nobody has called to worry you as in right, so your, your song let's sounds let's like let's mine let's or something like that. Yeah. Like say yeah. a, a song like uh, Slow Down. Slow Down. Slow down. If, I, if I tell you where we got it from, you will be very surprised. We got it from um, that Kudrenji song. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, but it's not even close. Like when you listen, to, yes, yeah. that's what you call inspiration. Yeah. I got you. Like our song, "Kiss Your Hand," the beat, it's a mixture of one they call bumper to bumper, right. and Ron Brown's. He had a big song at that time. <laughs> okay. You know, fasten the tempo. There's a way we work around it. Okay. But I hope I hope you not be worried if anybody. No, like this are, are no no out. this one is not. Oh, so, uh, 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 nah. we know how uh, our musicians uh, are like this. And I'm not saying you Oh, uh, uh, no problem, uh, okay. no problem. All right, now let's talk about. For um, one person, too, is our guy. You know, it's our, yeah. it's our brother. You know. Yeah. It's. I think it's more of a compliment. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But you spoke to him before. Oh, we even spoke to him recently, like yeah. a week ago. Yeah. Or, That's nice. Yeah. That's nice. Now, which of the songs did you find it difficult putting together? You know, sometimes you don't even remember. <laughs> when you started to record, yeah. Yeah. so you won't even know. It's not really. It's just. Uh, how do I put this? You know, sometimes the songs gets to you, it comes to you from yeah. when you start listening to the beat. It's like the beat is talking. Yeah. Sometimes you actually hear voices behind the beat. Pay attention to it and just respect what you hear. Yeah. So sometimes I don't even stress myself that much. How, how far do you envision this album to go? How far? As far as it can go and oh, yeah. as far as we, we have done our parts mm -hmm. and we are still doing our parts as far as promoting it, right? But the ultimate result is not in our hands. Okay. You know, that's how we live our everyday life. We put our best foot forward. And then whatever comes comes. Yeah, you featured Whiskey on one. It's not the first time you are featuring Whiskey on any yeah. song. How is your relationship with Whiskey like? Solid. A tight brotherhood. A tight brotherhood. Very very tight. Like wow. It's just like you see, like me and Mugis and Kill Beats, yeah. right? We have a tight brotherhood. Yeah. Or Hene, all yeah. of these are boys. Yeah. Wiz is part of that brotherhood. Wow. Yeah. And recently he made all of us proud on the international Amazing. Scene, selling out the old Amazing. And now I've asked this question to um, other musicians. And one, one, one person actually told me that the only group of musicians in Ghana who can also sell the O2 arena are R2Bs. Wow. <laughs> heard it too? Have you heard it? Oh, yeah. Not just now, not even just 
selling out to arena like people see us out sometimes and come and talk to us yeah. tell us that yo you guys go feel carry Ghana go the next yeah. level not just with the selling of shows yeah. but even with the music they feel like mm. we can take Ghana to that next level yeah. you know and it's, it's cool. not happening it's not happening oh we're doing it's our part happen. sure it's happening we are doing our oh, part yeah. Yeah, we're doing our part. Yeah, okay, we're not, we're not doing this for us. We're doing it for I know, yeah. and there's one thing you guys always say: we don't do music for awards, we don't do music for accolades. Oh, yeah, 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 we're yeah. just doing what we can do. Yes, and that is what uh, is keeping you. You, you know, <laughs> what we say that what we are, it's not like we we are trying to be arrogant. I got you. You know, what we're trying to say is, you see, we we're, were born in community one side fifteen. Okay, growing up, life was tough. What to eat? You know, it was a whole struggle. This life is 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 heaven bonus. All right. You know, to be for us to be paid the amount of money we are being paid for live shows, how much we are making from streaming endorsements. You know, oh, this one. Why should I be? I, don't know, I think it's an illusion. You know, I want plastic thing somebody carry from China come. You no, know, and you won't kill yourself for that one. Nah, bro. <laughs> you, I, know, I, you know, you look past it. I get it's, you. And even if you, when you win an award, you don't realize it's a, it's a pride thing. Okay. It's pride. And in life, once anything that magnifies your ego, okay. it's going to kill you. Okay. So you should you shouldn't be practicing. Mm -hmm. you, you, you are going to don't die. Go. Yeah, you are <laughs> going to die. Go. You know, if you put your your hopes or your life in that, you know, people praising you, you know, uh, so we don't care at all yeah. like legit don't care yeah. uh, we've won a lot of awards yeah, mind I know you that. I know that. plenty of our awards are with our friends because most of the, like ghana music awards we don't go unless maybe we have to they go they take on our behind they take it home they take it home they take it home but does it not seem that you guys are very late but you're doing good music but it appears in India, you need to be we are too soft, we are too cool. No, you're not soft, and you're not Not soft as in not wild, but you guys, no, probably be a money, be a pressure. No, not me, pardon, so pretty. We live in an abundant world, you know, but because our as some of our can only go for preno, anything a year breno, because we live in an abundant world, but we are killing ourselves with competition. Okay. For me to win, you have to lose, okay. and this is the world we are in. When I win, you lose. This one, when you lose, you win. Somebody. Why lose. can't we all win together? Yes, that's the kind of world we are. We, we, it's abundant, but if you like, for instance, why should we have starvation problem in the world? The world that we to two baby out the BBC a baby fifty. You understand what I'm saying? It just tells you how wrong we've we've gotten it as a society. Yeah. And these small small things are part of why we've collectively gotten it wrong. Like putting too much emphasis on our world. Who we need our world? Because because if you if I will release a song, because as you can see at every award show, plenty of people too don't win. More people don't win. So it's not even an event that that celebrates artists. Because yeah. most of the artists are gonna go home sad. Everybody has worked so hard because for you to be nominated, it means you are doing so well. Yeah. Now the song that was nominated, the people don't like it. We've met people that told us. One girl we met one time, she told us she was in depression when we released Walai. She was in America. Okay. You remember for TV3, and and our song took her out of depression. This one and award, no. Which one? What, what, which one be important? I understand. <laughs> you know what I mean. But. I and I'm also happy that um, you accepted to do grant interviews because when I heard that interview, I said, hey, they pay interview because it always you want to tweak our, our, our Not story. our in particular, but our it's industry, a general like thing. Your colleagues. Yeah. So I was, I was wondering if Arthur Bees was going to do interview, like going around to do interviews for this project. But now you are here, yeah. I'm happy to interview you because I'm on, I'm on blacklisted <laughs> <laughs> media for oh, interviewing you. Know, you, know, you. Know. So when I, when I read that, I thought, oh, it, it appears our people are now going to keep away from the media. But once you are here, it means no, 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 no. you are still I think it. even they got it out of uh, proportion because what I, I was trying to say, yeah. it's not like we are against the media. Yeah. I'm just saying, and I said it earlier in our interview at HITS, that I'm challenging the media to be more responsible. Okay. You know, like in life, as a human being, you can live anyhow, because police know they are top, okay. you know? So you can live anyhow you want, mm -hmm. but you don't live anyhow. 
Okay. Right? Sure. Exactly. So that's what I'm trying to say. Okay. In a, because the world right now, people are so interested in clicks, clicks, clicks. You know, so if it's at your expense, I don't care, provided I'm going to get clicks. That's it. That's all I'm just trying to say, that the media should be more responsible. All right. So tell us where we can get to listen to... Um, the Back to basics. Every platform store be a Okomamu or Initi or store at your Tunto positions. Positions. Back to basics. Come on, collateral. Yeah, they are fraud. You may be. Yeah, they are fraud. Gary. Yeah, they are fraud. Eh, Sichiri. If you want to meet on online stores, no. Oko provision store be a. Catch up with our talk, Gary. Back to basics. The end. I want to make a provision store. Local community one marketer. Mami or Tony Tosi. Yeah, they are fraud in Tosi now, man. Back to basics. No. Back to basics, man. To Tony Tosi, no. All the ST, you know. I consume it back to basics. All right. So, so you have them. You can get right. basics tap, tap, on tap, all streaming platforms. Yes. Go stream it. Listen to it. And then let's hear what you have to say about the album. My name is Kwame. That has been great having R2Bs now. We are yeah, R2Bs. Yes. Yeah, refuse to be. We refuse to be broke. Oh, <laughs> Thank you Thanks for having coming. Us, bro. Thank and you for make having sure us. you log on to www.ganaweekend.com yep. and subscribe to Ghana Weekend TV. Bye bye.